this rainforest is original. It has never been cut. Nobody has ever come in here and done anything to these trees. So this is a really special part of the rainforest. And one of the first things we've seen here is this really, really cool ant mound. You can see it's about seven feet long and it goes all the way down the length of this tree. Millions of tiny ants are living here in a symbiotic relationship with this tree. Really, really cool. Come over here, let me show you something else we found. Over here is a black palm tree. This black palm tree actually has a termite mound on it. So these termites are arboreal, which means tree dwelling, and they are living on this black palm. But the really cool thing about this black palm tree is this tree is used by the Embera Indians that we met the other day for several different purposes. This bark is very strong and flexible and this is what they use to make the floors of their huts with. When we walked on it, it felt almost like we were walking on springs. It gave a whole bunch but they said it was one of the strongest woods in the jungle. The tree also provides the, the strips of palm fiber that they use to make their baskets out of. So this is a really special tree to the native Indians. And the really cool thing is they don't have to destroy this tree. They just take little strips of this bark off. The tree grows back, protects itself. They never destroy the tree, but they get to use all the resources from it. This black palm tree here also has some, um, some, some palm nuts growing on it that aren't ripe yet. But if we come over here, right next to it is another palm tree whose nuts are ripe. So if we look, Way up high in this tree, those orange fruits are ripe palm nuts. And we can see here, although this, this palm protects itself like a porcupine. Thousands and thousands of little prickly sticks, but right here is one of the palm nuts that's fallen. And if I can get it out, ooh, I can show you how cool it is. The neat thing about this palm nut, no animals can climb up this tree because of all these prickly little prickers, like a porcupine. But birds can fly in and safely eat, eat these nuts from the palm. So this tree provides a safe place for some big birds like macaws and parrots to come and eat. We'll see you next time on Paradise Earth Kids TV.